Scripture alone fell apart for me when I posed the question to myself, why do I believe the doctrine? Why do I believe in Sola Scriptura? And I recognized instantly that I believed it because my tradition had transmitted it to me. It was on the authority of tradition that I believed in Scripture alone. That seemed absurd to me. But then when I began to break it down further, I realized that the doctrine was incoherent at several levels. One of them, of course, is that Christ himself never indicates to us that we are to discern the Christian faith from an examination of the Bible. On the contrary, yeah. Jesus gives provisions for handing on the faith, and his provisions were oral tradition and the teaching authority of the magisterium. Go therefore into all nations, make disciples, teach them everything I have commanded you, all of which was oral. I'll be with you to the end of the age. Do this in memory of me. Whoever sins you forgive are forgiven. As the Father sends me, I, so I send you. Whatever you bind on earth is bound in heaven. St. Paul receives that by way of tradition. The tradition I receive from the Lord I hand on to you. And as often as we eat this bread and drink this cup, we proclaim the Lord's death until he comes. So it was oral tradition, the sacred liturgy, teaching office of the church until he comes again. Yeah. No mention of the Bible alone. So that was one problem. And then logically, it, it just fell apart because you can't discern. There's no principled way as a Protestant to tell the difference between dogma and opinion. Even if we look at the Bible and disagree, how do we know if that disagreement is substantive or not? No way to know. And so the doctrine was, uh, was just reduced to philosophical absurdity in an instant. And I lost the, you know, I lost the faith, really, yeah. over that. Yeah.